Good morning, my dear kids. In our last class, we had started our chapter six, that is, input and output devices, and we learned about input, process, and output, that is, IPO cycle. So, kids, now you know that how our computer works. Our computer performs basically four tasks. First one is takes information, that is, input, store it. Process it and gives result. That is your output. So, in common, all computers have four things. That is input, storage, processing, and output. So, in today's class, we'll talk about input devices. Let's have a look at some input devices. Kids, you all are familiar with this input device. This is a keyboard. Yes, my dear kids, keyboard is an input device which we use to enter words and numbers into the computer it has many keys we have already studied all the keys of keyboard it has different keys like numeric keys alphabet keys special keys punctuation keys and many more now let's talk about next input device i'll give you a hint for this i am not afraid of a cat sit on a mat have a long tail who am i yes my dear kids it's mouse mouse is also an input device which is used to draw pictures and select objects on the computer screen and it is also known as pointing device i think you also remember the inventor of mouse who is the inventor of mouse Yes, my dear kids, it's Douglas Engelbert. Douglas Engelbert is the inventor of mouse. Our next input device is joystick. Kids, a joystick is an input device which is used to play games on the computer. It is used to control a character or machine in a computer program. Kids, it is commonly used to control video games. It consists of a base and a stick that can be moved in any direction to control or give command to your character in the video game.